Hello, Oracle Dragon Star here with a psychic psychic guided message. If you were guided here today, this message is for you from someone you know in your inner circle. Um, so let's get started. I love your face. You're so beautiful. Drop dead gorgeous. Your curly hair. Your eyes. I can just fall into. Your lips. I want to kiss. And feel your tongue. And how soft your skin is. You seem so gentle, so earthy, so spiritual, so loving, so flowing. I just want to melt into you. I look at your picture and pleasure myself thinking about you. I feel like I'm sinning when I do this. And <clears throat> I just want you so much. You seem to be on top of the world. You're definitely on top of my world. So wild, so free, so carefree, so just, you just remind me of freedom. That power that you have. Not afraid to go out guns blazing or even naked in front of everybody and telling everybody to fuck off. I love your ass. <laughs> and... Oh my gosh, the way you control things is just blows my mind, takes me to another world in this universe. I want to fly to you, go to you, be where you are, because you are what drives me fills me with passion and desire and happiness, pleasure. I feel like you are guiding me out of this darkness to the light. I hope I don't come off as like a creep. But also there is some around me that don't want to let me go. That try to hold on so tight and do anything. Like a crazy psycho freak. <laughs> Even out in public, it's pretty degrading and disgusting. And blows me away. I get shocked with it. I think of dancing with you, holding you. I feel so darker than you. Like you're just this shining light with your gorgeous hair, gorgeous body. I love everything about you. I'm going through this transformation. To not feel the way that I do about myself. Like death. I feel like death. 
You feel so far away from me. And that your back's turned for me. And I want to reach out to you. I feel like I'm reaching out to you, but you're so far away. So above me. So higher than. Not better than. But I do feel that way sometimes. You do have a perfect ass. I'm just telling you that. So smack that ass. No matter what you're wearing, you're beautiful. Just your natural self is beautiful. I always want to tell you that. Like a butterfly. Exotic. Unique. So free. I pleasure myself a lot when it comes to thinking about you, fantasize about you, and girls, go back to the back room where you were. For a moment, I'm recording. I'll tell you when I'm done. Just for a moment. What's going on? Since you hurt my finger. How? By just trying to do this. Why are you bending Sissy's finger backwards? Where's your sister? Oh, I am. Oh good. I'll talk to her in a minute. I need to finish. I'm going to finish this video because I can't pause it at the moment. I need you. I need you guys to go in the back and play nice for a moment. Um, I don't know why you're bending her finger backwards. For what? what? Why were you doing I was that? No, I didn't mean to. I was trying to help her get the fucking shit off her foot. But no, she's going to still cry because she wouldn't let me help her. Yeah, but she said you bent back her finger. That doesn't have anything to do with her foot. Because she was trying to protect her foot. And I accidentally bent her finger backwards. So that's on her. That's your fault. What's Rachel. wrong with your foot? There was handcuffs on her foot. She was trying to get up. up. And I was like, can I help you? And I was trying to help her. And she's like, no. And she was trying to block her feet so I can help. If she doesn't want your help, she doesn't want your help, just leave her alone. You know that. I told you that before. Okay. Both of you, don't this start. Don't start. You guys go back to the back. I'm recording right now. And it's being interrupted. And I'm not finished. But when I'm finished, I'll let you know. You can take the... No, no, yeah. You can take the computer to the back if you want to play on it for a little bit. Okay. Mommy's doing an adult video. Oh, or you can get your headphones unless you want to get your headphones on. A what video? Where is They're right video? here. Yeah. Grab them. Come on. I want the other ones. Well, those work too. Come on, you're ruining the video with all of this. Give her that headphones so I can finish. God, I'm already going to have to edit so much.
Can you plug it in and get it on? The t clock is ticking. Time is ticking. I'm doing a video. I can't stop it. Why not? Because it doesn't do pause breaks. Quit talking to me and go do something. <clears throat> Put your headphones on, Rachel. I should just start over. I want to pleasure you. I want to see you pleasuring yourself. See your body. I'm wearing some cute tights. One of my jackets. I just want to look at you and how beautiful you are. You set me on fire. I feel all this passion towards you. You have the key to my heart, which I have locked right now being connected to this other person. <clears throat> it's locked. But I know who holds the key to my heart. I want to marry you. I know you're upset. I know you're sad and lonely. I know you feel probably without love, that no one cares, but I love you greatly. I want to marry you. I write my emotions and feelings about you a lot. And I want to send you these messages. I want you to know how much I love you and give you beautiful gifts. I feel like time is running out. There has been chaos and madness with this other person I've been around, which is making a huge delay challenge and obstacles and burdens on me. I feel like I'm suffering when it comes to you in this situation, you being so far away, me feeling like I'm really not good enough for you. But I have all these emotions that drive me into so much suffering, so much pain. I feel like I'm being punished. But I want to be the one for you. I want to be that gentleman in your life. I cherish you. You are my happiness, my passion, this tenderness, feelings I have for you. And I want children and a house. And share great love with you. I'm also conflicted because I wonder if you're with another man. 
another person. I'm scared and I'm really possessive over you. And, but I want to be strong when it comes to this situation. When it comes to you, I want to be that loyal person where we can go outside and be together, go to parties together, have fun together. I feel like it's destiny written in the stars. I'm going to come to you with these hidden emotions and secrets that I hide and tell you everything that's been going on in my life. You are my happiness. Not these thief people that are only out for themselves that would like to see me dead and gone then always have tricks up their sleeves for me that are just like enemies not even friends I do write about you a lot a great deal write out my feelings and emotions which leaves me in these dark clouds dark thoughts but I am having wisdom about them knowing the truth about which road I should take to get away from this snake and come to you and be childlike and have new beginnings change newness haha <laughs> that's a secret but I really want to impregnate you I'm so hurt of being separated from you and the situation and the things that have happened in my life. But I'm going to come quickly to you because I feel that you are mine and I just want to take you away before someone else gets to you. I feel like when it comes to you, I am new at all of this. Sometimes you make me afraid because you're so, you know, it seems like you're so full of life, like so big when it comes to life, like this star, this greatness, this like just has everything people coming after you just everything and I feel like I don't know like I'm not good enough but I do have great emotions for you great desire and passion and want to be with you and connected to you it hurts me so much I feel like I'm coming slowly towards you and not quick enough. Entangled in sexual obsessions and addictions that I have with the people around me. I want to stand in my truth and become stable and grounded but I feel like this old dying thing when it comes to you and how beautiful you are and just to be able to touch you 
I have so much love and emotion and desire for you. I would eat you out if you let me. And watch you play with yourself. Or me play with you. I want you on me. You make me so hard. Just the thought of you embracing me. I do feel like this something's going on with destiny and the stars. You are definitely a star. Everyone loves you. You're so independent, on fire. Take care of yourself. Just great body, great everything. I have great desire when it comes to you. Sometimes I feel like I just want to show you off and be like, oh my god, look what I got, which I know I don't want to be that way to just treat you as like an object because you're so beautiful, vulnerable, and open, and honest, so loving, and those are my feelings towards you. I want to manifest you, I think of you, and just wish that I can manifest something with you. And I'm so nervous when it comes to my emotions and feelings about you. You feel so beyond me. So many was chasing after you, sawing after you. I truly do love that ass. I watch you through the screens. I watch what you do through social media. You are like this star that's so far away, so beautiful, just like a dream. If I could just travel to you and be free and open like you are and be so happy. I want to be spontaneous and out in the open with you and not scared to be free and open with you out in the open. I want to make passionate love to where our emotions are overflowing, filled with joy and passion, where I leave you running wet all over the place, all over me. I just really want to see you and pleasure you and have you. But I'm afraid when it comes to you, someone's watching me and it has caused chaos. Because I desire you so much. And I look at your letters and your pictures. And they just hover over me. You're so beautiful and independent and abundant. Oh. So creative, so talented. 
so freeing. That is the truth. I want to take a leap of faith and come to you. That is my hidden desires and emotions. But I really feel that I don't deserve you. That I deserve what I got right now. Sorry.